Okay, okay so this is two. eight and four, and this is eight and four, and you multiply, which makes twelve squared. Yes. And twelve squared okay. equals six squared <laughs> times two squared. Okay. And six squared equals three squared times two squared. Therefore, it gives 12 squared equals 3 squared times 2 squared times 2 squared. So this is 16 times 16, which is 16 squared, which equals 2 squared times 8 squared, which 8 squared equals 4 squared times 2 squared, and then 4 squared, four squared equals 2 squared times 2 squared. So 16 squared equals 2 squared times 2 squared times 2 squared times 2 squared. Squared is equal to two times two squared times ten squared, but since ten squared isn't a prime number, you can reduce it to two squared times five squared. So what's twenty squared equal to? Two squared times two squared times five squared. Mr. McKenzie, I did twenty. I chose 16 squared. 16 squared equals to um, eight, 8 squared, which is not a prime number, times 2 squared, which is a prime number. And the reason I didn't break this down because it's a prime number. Then that equals to 4 squared um, times 2 squared, which is a prime number, which equals to 2 squared times 2 squared, which are both. What, e what equals 2 squared times 2 squared? Uh, this. Uh, both 4 of them? squared. 4, the four squared. squared. Yeah. Okay. And so 2 squared times 2 squared are both prime numbers. Mm -hmm. And so I got here to 16 squared. 16 squared is 256. So if you go 2 times uh, 2 times 2 times, no, 2 times 2 and then 4 times. Well, actually, isn't it just the prime numbers? So the Yeah, it's the prime numbers. That's why I circled. So tell me what 16 squared is equal to on here. 256. Well, no, what is it equal to? Which which prime numbers? Uh, the red ones, right? Yeah. What are they? They're prime numbers. Can you then say the 16 squared equals? Equals to 2 squared times 2 squared times 2 squared times 2 squared. Okay, so it's 2 squared here, times 2 squared, yeah. times 2 squared, times 2 squared, and then you put it in here. Yeah. Oh, so that's one. Okay. Okay. So we have 18. Well, uh, 9 times 2 equals 18, and 3 times 3 times 2 equals also 18. These okay, why, why did you... Yeah, what are they? The, the, uh, they are prime factors. Good. Okay, uh, now we have 18, and we th then we put it into 18 squared, which equals 324. 18 times 18 equals 324. We, we uh, divide them, right? Divide them, and we get uh, 9 squared times 2 squared. Uh, nine squared equals eighty one, and two squared equals four. So we go. We go eighty one times four. Eighty one times four, which equals two hundred twenty four. Three hundred twenty four. Three hundred twenty four. Then we can also uh, divide, uh, so, uh, divide it by three squared and three squared. 18 squared equals 3 squared times 3 squared equal, uh, times 2 squared. Okay, so you've broken it into yes. its prime, the prime square factors. of its prime factors. Yes. The same way you did up here. Yes. So all you did is you turned this equation here yes. into yes. squares. Yes. So it's exactly the same. Yes. Okay. Okay, so this is 24 squared, this is 24, and that's 24 times each other is 24 squared. So 24 squared equals 12 squared times 2 squared, and 12 squared equals 6 squared times 2 squared, and 6 squared equals 3 squared times 2 squared, therefore 24 squared equals 2 squared times 2 squared times 2 squared times 3 squared.